you hadn't been driving yet. Mm -hmm. We didn't you stop the car yet. Uh -huh. Okay. You say we got into a heated argument while heading home. That's what you say in your answer that mm -hmm. you swore to. So now you're telling me that you weren't heading home, you were just in the parking lot. You hadn't started yet. Mm -hmm. Okay. So now he's gesticulating with his hands and... And while he's doing this, he's touching me. He's like touching my shoulder, touching he my touched, arm. So just touching a second, my shoulder, touching just my a arm. second. So he was gesticulating with his hand and he touched your arm. Mm -hmm. And what did you do? I, I have your over. answer. He still keeps going. I move over. He still keeps going. He's doing this. He hits my shoulder. I go like this to move, to block. My hand connects with his um, like eyebrow, like this part of his face. Then he goes, I can't believe you hit me. He gets up, he gets out of the car, slams the door. Before he slams the door, he says, I gotta walk. Then he gets out of the car. I mean, I have your answer here. The story that you're telling me doesn't bear any relation to the sworn oh, statement that you had I understand, but here. I'm not the one who wrote that. Well, I'm telling you, you the truth right just, now. Listen to me. Before you came in here, you were a very intelligent young woman. I still am. Before you came in here, you read this over and you signed it. Mm -hmm. And if there were any changes that you wanted to make in here, you could have. I did. Not here. I didn't see any changges. I said that they should have been made, but that, that I was assured that that was just paraphrasing. And no, that no, I'd no. Be, and that I would no, have no, to no. Then we're going to go. Here. Then we're going to go out, and you're going to write up an answer. Read it very carefully. You're not to be shown this answer that you wrote and swore to, and write up an answer that I can examine you on. Okay. Because what his claim is that you had him falsely arrested, and he says that you punched him in the face. Not true. Well. Well, whatever you say, that's what he says. And there is an indication here that that did, in fact, happen. So you're going to go outside and find the producer who you say told you this is just paraphrasing and redo it. Okay. Perfect. Why is our excuse? This will be recalled. Oh, it's so good to be able to get a whole story. <laughs> so now, Miss Wigglesworth, I have seven pages of story and... When we get down to it, when I sort of put it all together, two people in a car, both of whom probably had, maybe were feeling good that night, feeling bad, but feeling good, got into a fight. You probably got the worst of the deal, but it's clear from here that despite the fact that he put his hand on you, you physically assaulted him by slapping him the first time, the second time by punching him in the face, because you say in your document that you gave me that he's driving and swerving because you're arguing with him, and he's holding your cell phone in his left hand. Yes. That's what you said. Yes. And with his right hand, as he's driving and swerving, he's choking you. That's what you said right here. And I'm trying to figure out how he's steering. <laughs> So it's all very nasty. And then you say, stop the car, you got out, he still had your phone, you wanted your phone, he touched you, you punched him. So I do want to clear just, up. Just, just, just a second. Mm -hmm. that's, what, that's what you say in here. And he, of course, has pictures, like you have pictures, of, of injuries. I'm sure he does, right? Absolutely, I right. do have my injuries. And you pictures. have pictures of your injuries to your knee, right? No, I don't have pictures of injuries, but I do have text just messages where he admits that he just has... A sec. Listen to me carefully, I'm did. not finished yet. Oh, okay. You both behaved badly on the night of the 28th or the 29th, whichever one it was. Now, he was arrested, and then he filed a lawsuit against you after yes. he was arrested. Yes. yes. And then you both had lawyers and went to court. I no, did not you get did a not. lawyer. She did not you did not. You had, you had, according to you, legal advice. Yes. So am I correct from reading this? Because my interpretation of that evening was you both acted badly. I mean, that's just, that's not the truth. That's incorrect. You just, shh, just a second. I well, apologize. I know you acted badly. I acted I in self-defense. I know that you acted badly. I acted in self-defense. So I know that you, badly, okay. I know that you acted badly. I know, I know that, that in response in to somebody touching your shoulder, you don't punch him in the face. I didn't punch him in the Can face. Can I see the picture? That's not what happened. Sure. So what I'm saying to you is, he has to acknowledge to me that, first of all, you're out until 2 o'clock in the morning, and you've been bar hopping, mm -hmm. and the smart thing to do is call an Uber. If you have been excessive, uh, excessively drinking, uh, no. yes. If you... I haven't... When you've been mm -hmm. drinking, you never know that it's excessively. Absolutely. 